niggas know my pyroclastic flow. You niggas know my pyroclastic flow, flow, flow. You niggas know my pyroclastic flow. It's R A W, R A W. You're looking at the Grand Wizard, Warlord, vocal cords so vicious. And I don't have to show riches to pull up, pull off with some bad bitches. And it ain't about chivalry, it's about dope lyrics and delivery. It's about my persona, ain't nothing like a man that can do what he wanna. Ain't nothing like a man that you knew on the corner. See him come up and fuck up the owner. See him throw up Westside California. Nigga, I'm hot as Phoenix, Arizona. I'm Utah, I got multiple bitches, it's a new law. Keep a hold of your riches, dumb nigga, don't spin it. As soon as you get it, and recognize I'm a captain, you a lieutenant. I can say what I wanna say, ain't nothing to it. Gangsta rap made me do it. Made me do it. If I call you a nigga, ain't nothing to it. Gangsta rap made me do it. I can act like an animal, ain't nothing to it. Gangsta rap made me do it. Made me do it. If I eat you like a cannibal, ain't nothing to it. Gangsta rap made me do it. I'm raw as a dirty needle, choke a eagle, just to feed all my people. Lyrically, I'm so lethal. Plant thoughts in their mind just to defeat you. Ice Cube is a saga. Y'all spit saliva and I spit lava. spit lava. I got the fearless flow. Don't get near this hoe if you scared to go. I keep it gangster. And why should I change that? Fuck you, old motherfuckers trying to change say rap. What, say what? But ain't you the same cat that sat back when they brought cocaine say back? Say what? Say what? I'm trying to get me a made back. How you motherfuckers gonna tell me don't say that? You the ones that we learned it from. I heard nigga back in 1970. It's good, folks. Permanent Patriot. Here with some good stuff. For once. And. Once again, it was DMX who brought it to my attention. Because, <laughs> uh, this shit going on with the music industry is incredible. All these fucking musicians with this shit. If I ever see this shit in person, and I know that you know, what it is, you're done. Straight up. It'd be two less fingers that you'll have. Think about music, folks. Uh, you know, just by not having any emotion, you can throw on any song and it will make you feel a certain way. Correct? Now, let's say, let's say you're having a moment of doubt in life. You don't know what to believe in. You don't know if anything's real. You're just looking for answers. You're really depressed. You're suicidal. Then you hear a song like Head Up by DMX or Angel by DMX or Changes by Tupac. It can go on forever. And you hear one of those songs and it's like a fucking punch in the mouth from God. Is it not? It's like, you want to know where? I'm right here but right in your soul. And it's the same thing with, with intuition, or whatever you want to call it, guardian angel. You know, the thing inside that's, that talks to you, your inner self. Do you think that's you, or something else? Because I think a lot of people are forgetting that we're not humans, and we're just using these bodies. Here's here's a, a good one that I got from Trey Smith. You have a physical body. You also have a conscience. One of these 
dies. What happens to the other one? Hello? Anybody? Life after death, right there. And I didn't have to do anything or show anything or anything. There's good and bad. Cause and effect. Problem solution. Uh, you know, they go on and on. How about deja vu? Folks, do you know what happens when you go to sleep? Do you really know what happens, though? I mean, do you know if, like, you are a computer, and the fucking matrix gets turned off, and who the fuck knows what happens while you're asleep? But think about that, when you have moments of deja vu. When, like, and I mean, there's times when I know, without a shadow of a doubt, that it's deja vu. It's like, how, well, how the hell can this happen again like this? Hello? <laughs> We're over here on nabirusunset.wordpress.com. This is uh, truthsoldier.com's page. Wow! Uh, I showed this page many times. I'm going to mention a few things that I want to explain. And I think are an obvious sign of God. That there is a God. A lot of these showing up lately. Now, this video right here is unfucking real. Now, the depiction of this is multiple suns rising. Now, there's another video on here called Two Suns. That's it. Strange sunset. Here we go. Can you explain the sunset? Okay. That's the one that we got right now. Then this one. Two suns. Two suns. Not Venus, not the moon. Two suns. Okay? But this one. There's another good one right here. Look, look. I mean, folks. Does this look like some kind of a being? Or does it look like a sun? Now, I want you to notice right here. Notice the little flickers. Like wings. See them? Watch. It looks like something walking. Uh, am I the only one seeing that? Does that look like two suns to anybody? To me. And let me just point out this, this right here. That's the sun. What the rest of it is, I will leave up to you for interpretation. I think I have a very, very good idea of what it is. And see how long it goes on for, eight minutes. Uh, actual video I think is like a half hour long. Folks. Okay, fuck that, fuck that. 
we're just going to cover the whole video. Because this is just incredible. It's pretty damn obvious to me what it is. But you know, when I post stuff like this, or the space stuff, nobody really questions me on anything. Except for the flat earth. Which is probably the simplest fucking thing to prove out of all the conspiracy theories. I don't get it. I mean, I'm questioning shit here. I want to know what the fuck that is. Because I know what it's not. There's nothing out there. It's a fucking projection. Space, I mean. Okay, you got your freaking, you know, your heaven and your hell tube, if you will. Dimensions. Dimensions. But there's nothing, there's nothing out there. Okay, it's in the fucking dimensions. Please don't make me try to be smarter than I am. I mean, this is fucking, this is elementary school science that we're talking about here, folks, with the fucking flat earth and the chemtrails and the GMO shit. I don't know what people's fucking problem is. The only thing I can think of is fluoride. That's all I can think of. The chemtrails. I mean, through the natural process of evolution, we're not getting stupider, are we? Do you folks, some of you may recognize this scene right here. This is from the video I did a long time ago, which I've reposted many times with the strange sounds in the sky. The trumpets and the gates of hell opening. Same fucking city. Uh, the shit I showed with um, the holograms, I think, or the floating city. Same city. Uh, this shit right here. Same city. Okay, about four or five fucking epic videos have come from this very spot. Halifax. I just wanted to point that out. I'd like to also point out that each one of these videos makes very clear that we have a flat earth. Not a flat planet, morons. A flat earth. And yes, obviously some people don't know the difference between a fucking circle and a sphere and a ball and a globe. Obviously, or we wouldn't be having this flat earth debate. How many times do I got to read the first page of the Bible? The only thing I can add up with these with these people that are obviously intelligent, but making the most moronic comments is that they're either disinfo agents, people of Satan, or that's just how they get their fucking kicks. Because any sane, intelligent human being cannot explain any of this shit that I show you away. I don't have to show anything to anybody all you need to hear is my words, and then you can go and type it into the little fucking box you got sitting in front of you. Look into some of the shit yourself, and then you can come and talk shit, okay? And I'd love to hear your argument for the fucking amazing, incredible, undeniable proof I got. I told you, I live on one of the loudest fucking roads in the city. Which is why I always keep my window shut. It's fucking beautiful today, so I open the window. Oh. My. God.
come over to dambirusunset.wordpress.com. Just look at some of these topics. And you tell me that I'm bullshitting about any of the shit that I cover. God bless and carry on.